Good morning everyone, welcome back to the channel. Um, guys, today we're going to be talking about a species that's not as common on uh, at least this Durban, Durban area over here. We're looking really more of a tropical species. So the guys, especially fly fishing there, Alphonse side, Seychelles, sort of up Maldives area like that is where you're going to get these species. But we do get them all the way down to us, so it's a species we do, we, we do need to cover. This of course we're talking about is a blue hump head parrotfish. Um, they have all sorts of quirky little names that guys give them. Aqua Hulk is one of the ones that sort of stands out. Um, Chlorurus, oh, I'm, I'm forgetting names. Chlorurus, Sinensis, scientific name. We're talking about a fairly large parrotfish. They are, as you, as, as you can imagine with parrotfish, they've got sort of the fused teeth in the front. It forms a, a nice little beak. Now, when I say little with the, the bump heads, we're talking a beak the size of my two hands coming together like that. They are phenomenal coral eaters. They sort of grind the limestone and then take out all the um, organic matter out of that that they can. So often you'll see when they're swimming around, they, they excrete a lot. Um, and you'll see sort of limestone particles sort of traveling behind them. So it almost looks like a little smoke screen when they're, when they're swimming around. Now, as mentioned, predominant uh, feeding method, they're gonna be crushing corals. So, in terms of targeting them, it's uh, quite a tricky one. The, the only way to successfully target them, so when you talk about successful targeting, it's saying you can go out, the fish is there, you can put whatever you're doing in front of it, it's gonna eat it. The only success way to do that is really on fly tackle. So, the guys use about a 10 or 12 weight. They're throwing um, merkin crab imitations and those little alflexo crabs, things like that and actually sight fishing to these parrotfish. So you're throwing it in front of the school, you have to creep up on them. It's, if you have never seen this before, it's amazing, amazing how these guys work. Creep up on these parrotfish shoals, put it in front of them, and then obviously once you hook them, they take off like a madman. Because of the, they've got a very, let's get, get to the description there, a very, very large body, almost armor plated with their, their big uh, scales. That's normal with the parrotfish. Um, a blue to a sort of aquamarine color, They've got quite a bump on the top of the head where it gets their name from. So from their eyes goes up and it's got a pretty prominent uh, bump up there. Um, as mentioned, smallish eye, they're not a visual predator. And then those very, very large um, teeth or, or beak that they've got there in the front. Now, yeah, as we mentioned, crushing corals, um, more tropical areas that the fly fishing for them is phenomenal. It really took off at one stage. It's sort of died off. It's gotten, the guys are focused more onto milkfish now. Every generation, we, they're moving on to a new species, a new it, it thing. Um, it's a Western Indian ocean species, so outside of it, but really, so Dwana Bay is kind of the bottom limit. Uh, you, will, you could get them all the way down to Durban. It's not that much of a stretch, but yeah, you're really looking so Dwana Bay north. Yeah, it's one of those interesting species. Um, if you want more interesting species, guys, subscribe at the bottom of that, just one click away. Um, then you get constant updates to our channel uh, on the Aspen and the Kingfisher channel. Make sure you do both. And then click the bell icon, it gives you notifications as well. Sort of keep you up to speed with us. You don't have to worry, I wonder if they've released anything or not. It comes straight to you, it says, hey, there's a new video out. And then you can look at Ray and my ugly mugs. So guys, the bumphead parrotfish, beautiful species, very, very pretty. Um, they're very strong. Um, and yeah, they, they do eat certain things. So it's one of those things that if you wanted to look for something a little bit different to target, you've got your species. Cheers, guys.